Hi, this is Gail with Bernie and F. Naperville. And, you know, today I wanted to share something really cool with you that I found. So I used to work for Bernina of America. And way back in the day in 2016, we had the pleasure of working with Carl Cadwell, who is, in his own description, a noise sculptor or a sound sculptor. And it was a really fun thing because he takes like everyday items and turns them in to musical instruments. Well, he happened to turn Bernina into a musical instrument. So I just thought it was really cool if I took these videos. These are normally found. You can go right onto Bernina International's YouTube channel and find these, but they're two separate videos. But I wanted to combine them and explain to you why this is so cool because the first part of this that you're going to see is Carl actually giving his description of how he made his song and then in the second part of the video is the song so I hope you enjoy it uh, let me know what you think and uh, yeah come on take it away Carl <laughs> uh, hi everyone the <laughs> The first thing I want to do is kind of warn you that there are going to be a lot of flashing lights during the next uh, 10 minutes or so. So uh, if that sort of thing bothers you, you might want to cover your eyes or just step out for a little bit. Uh, but I just want to give a short explanation of what you're going to hear. Uh, I am a sound sculptor and musician, uh, a noise, kind of, I love noises basically is what I do. Um, Bernina asked me to create and perform a song using sewing machines and sewing machine noises. And I said yes before I knew what I was going to do. Uh, and I thought about it. Then they said yes, and I, I thought about it. And I thought, man, sewing machines really don't make that, kind of, that many noises. It's kind of a new world for me. But as you guys probably know, I was completely wrong about that. I went to the Bernina store in Chattanooga, where I live. And Bill uh, is a guy there who really helped me and Josh, my percussionist friend, find some really amazing noises. Um, we poked and prodded and like turned and took them apart and we just like violated these things, <laughs> making all these noises. Pretty sure Bill was able to put them all back together, so no worries there. But I'm going to demonstrate really quickly just a couple of the sounds that we got, um, so you'll know what you're hearing in the song. And I got my little controller here. That's the sound of, uh, it's very barbaric, we just took a sewing machine and slammed it on a desk. Is that sound? That's the sound of a pedal um, being depressed like a foot pedal. And then we hit and plucked the uh, needle. We got some nice kind of uh, cowbell kind of sounds. Uh, and then we, we even did some things that are a little bit more complicated where we put a stick inside where the gears are and turned the knob. I'm sure there's a name for that uh, knob, but I don't know it. But turned the knob and got like that kind of sound. So those are some nice percussive sounds. Um, and then there are even some of these machines, like these, this 8 series. I had no idea outside of factories this, this existed, but they sew by themselves. It's really crazy to me. I mean, I know for you guys, this is like everyday life. But for me, I was just watching this mesmerized. Uh, we, I got some beautiful sounds like this. Uh, that's the sound of like, you know, it's like going brrrr, that. But when I heard that sound, I thought that was beautiful because I can hear that that's a note. And so I changed that pitch a couple times. I can get some melodies going. So that kind of gives you an idea of, of what I did to the sounds. Um, and you're, there's lots more sounds that we got. I don't have time to go through all of them, but you will probably recognize them. Uh, about, they'll start off very raw, and then as the song goes on, they get more and more twisted and, and warped. And uh, yeah, and then another thing that happens about halfway through is I found some old Bernina infomercials from the 2000s, 2010s. Uh, <laughs> Very old ones. <laughs> Sorry. 
Not, not that old. Uh, but I, this, is, this is after me looking at Bernina's things for, you know, I was looking like, okay, this year, last year was all this stuff. And I finally found some that were really golden. I put them, I sampled them, put them in here, uh, use a bow coder, twist them around. And uh, yeah, it's going to be four minute light and uh, sewing machine ride. And I hope you enjoy it. Let's uh, get the lights down and get started. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. And don't forget to follow our Bernina of Naperville YouTube channel if you actually want to see some sewing videos, if you want to see some fun stuff, and, you know, for more of my DJing expertise. <clears throat> All right. Well, it's easy to find. It's youtube.com slash Bernina of Naperville. And there you can like, comment, and subscribe. Well, All right. I'm ready to hear some more cool tunes played on my Bernina. Not that one. <laughs> 